in this mod review, we're going to take a look at a 1956 Ford F100 for American Truck Simulator. Junior Senior. G'day YouTubers, it's Senior here from Junior Senior Gaming and today we're going to check out a mod review for American Truck Simulator and this is the 1956 Ford F100. Right, so it looks absolutely gorgeous. It really does. So let's check out what we can do in the customized configuration. So first of all, there's only one cabin, one chassis, there's only one engine which is a bit of a shame. It says a Cummins ISX 12370. I was hoping for um, like an old Ford F, you know, 351 or something like that or you know, some sort of, um, I don't know, maybe a big block Chevy, not Chevy, but, you know, big block Ford engine or something like that. Something, you know, V8 is what I was, what I was hoping for, but unfortunately, no, which is a real shame. Uh, transmission is a six-speed. Um, an Allison, it says Allison 4500 six-speed. Again, I was hoping for four on the floor, maybe, but... Yeah, well, you can't always get what you want, can you? We could pretend it's four on the floor. Now, the interior. Man, this is schmick. Look at that. That is so nice inside here. That is really cool. I love, I love this. Little dots on the top and everything. Oh, man, that is good. And the gauge is so clear so crystal clear you can see it I mean there's like your water temperature there oil I don't know what that is there there's a red dot there so I'm wondering if that's uh, missing texture probably I don't know there's your um, your odometer you know and you've got what's I don't know what that is Oh, battery battery there and there's your fuel gauge so that's pretty cool I mean you can see it all see there's your four on the floor and look at that that is really nice the seat and everything looks so good I mean that that is a lot of detail in there really is right let's stop ogling the interior and let's go off to the paint jobs now there's a few different paint jobs to choose with this you've got your sky blue which looks really nice you've got your white you've got your widow black you've got your pure red uh, sunny yellow custom color you can go and choose any custom color you your heart desires look at that dark red metallic which looks beautiful a sky blue metallic again that looks nice and a sunset sunset metallic I mean even the sunset metallic looks nice doesn't it uh, then we've got your custom metallic color Oh, do the custom metallic colors work? Oh, let's have a look. We'll go on the first one. There we go. There's number one working. And, oh, there's number two. Look at that. That looks nice, doesn't it? And number three. There we go. That looks so good. It really does. Um, something that um, I think is really really cool if we try and do like a candy can we do a candy apple here not really I was trying wondering if I could but yeah can't really do it can you which is a I suppose you could if you go and find the right color oh there we go that's sort of looking a bit better Oh yeah, look at that. That is nice. Oh yeah. Now uh, let's go to the accessories. Now there is um, a few accessories here. Uh, let's see, chrome bumper on the front. If you want to have a chrome bumper, then you've got the. Well, I don't know what that is there. I think it's just the badge there, on the front. You know what? I'm going to take that off. I think it looks better without it. Uh, the badge, but you can't do anything with that badge, so maybe in the future something would happen with that. Then we've got the mirrors on there. Well, there's only one kind of mirrors that you want there. And on the back here, you've got uh, no bumper, or you've got a bumper. However, you can 
Oh, no, it won't let you take it off. There we go. So no bumper. Let's put no bumper on there. That looks cool. <laughs> really cool. I like it. Um, it's, um, I know, probably a bit too much to ask, but a couple of accessory things like, you know, changing the back there to black or putting a cover, a tourner cover on the back there or, um, you know, maybe some lights across the side there or something like that, you know, to dress it up a bit. The option to do that is I reckon it's great because that way you can customize it and make it as good as you want anyway uh, maybe in the future so here we go with tires now it's not just the standard tires we've got white walls or you've got just your standard tires let's go white walls man love good white walls and also rims you can go your standard rims or you can go some mags those mags look pretty damn cool uh, nuts, you don't really want to put on your truck nuts for this because they just don't fit. So just leave them on your, your standard ones there. Uh, same thing for your hub. You don't want to put on the truck hub because look, it just doesn't fit. And just the standard. And then for the cover, I mean, again, it's going to look crap. So just leave it on the forward one there. That looks really nice, that does. Now, back over here again, the rims, the tires, let's have a look, white walls, and we'll put on those same tires that we, the rims that we had up the front, so it looks good, there we go, very, very nice, and um, I like how you can actually paint it black or, or whatever you want as well, that is a really cool option, but I'm just going to leave it as white, uh, red looks good, black, uh, no, white will do. We'll leave it as white. There we go. Now, let's have a look at the accessories for the inside. Well, not much, but this is definitely something that's in working progress. So, you know, you can see that... I, I can picture this. Now, just bear with me here. Um, you know those dots on the front, on the dash, that go on the dash? You have the dots on the dash... And you have your hula girl on the dash, you know, dancing while you're driving along. Um, you can have, you know, some other things like you want, like, dice dangling from here, you know, from the mirrors. That would be cool. Um, what else would you have? Um, you know, something on the, on the, like, your girlfriend. There you go. A girl on the seat next to you. That would be cool. And, and maybe some stuff in the back there, like some boxes or a motorbike or, you know, something like that. It would be would make it that extra bit more special. But at the moment, this is a great start. I love it. I really do. So let's confirm that. And look at the bloke in there as well. He's like, hey, man, look at me. I'm in my Ford, you know, for F100 is really cool. You know, that's, that's just great. Okay, let's, <laughs> let's do a trade-in. And there we go. And we'll jump outside and have a look. Okay. Yes. And look, didn't take too long to load. And this is at the Peterbilt dealer, guys. If you're ever wondering where the hell you can get this from, well, Peterbilt. And we're just waiting for the map to load there. And a little bit jaggedy. They took a little bit to load, but anyway, look at that. Doesn't that look so cool? That just looks so cool. I cross my fingers. I hope it has got a thumping V8 sound in there. I really do hope. Cross my fingers. Actually, you know what would be really good? A back attachment for this that where you could hook on a trailer. That would be cool. That would be really cool. Chrome exhaust there. Oh, man. Looks nice. All right. Here we go. Jump on the outside here. Are we going to get the V8 thumping sound? Cross your fingers. No. Ah, oh, so let down. <gasps> no. It's a Cummins engine. I was hoping we were going to get a big thumping V8. It just doesn't sound right, does it? You look at that and you're going, there's a truck nearby. Where's the truck? I, I can hear a truck, but it's just, yeah, it doesn't sound right. All right, turn the lights on. There's the lights. High beams. Uh, flashes. There's the flashes. Horn. No, it needs to be more of a, you know, the, the beep beep sort of sound that the old school trucks and cars had. Oh, well. 
That's just wrong. There's air horns somewhere in there. I don't know where they're sitting, but anyway. Uh, wipers. Yes, we have wiper animation. Yes. That is cool. Look at that. That's great. I love it. It works well. Um, what else do we have on the outside? That is it. Flashes. Uh, all right. Okay. Look, they even work on the inside. That's cool. And look, there you can see in the mirror the model as well. Oh, so much details put into this. It's really good. Now, cross your fingers. Let's push the display. Oh, yeah. There we go. Oh, very good. Okay, flash is off. Let's turn the wipers off. There we go. Let's just ignore that it is... Um, it's got a truck sound in there and we'll just try and just yeah try and drive it the way it is okay that mirror was flicking just then Let's see if that continues it might have just been at the start no it flickered again well look it's driving quite nice I mean, it doesn't sound like the truck you would expect it to. I was... There's the mirror flicking again. It's got... There's the exhaust brakes there. Oh, that's a shame. It really is. Sorry, Mr. Truck. I nearly hit you. Ah, oh, you know what? This, this could be so much more. It really could. Um, I, I think that... If they just put a little bit more time into it, it could be a lot better. So, uh, but for now, this is actually good. But it could be better. <laughs> um, I'm going to do something stupid, and I'm going to quickly go and see, will this pick up a load? All right, let's, let's just check the load here market the freight market what do we got that's around town here um yep that one will do and uh we will quickly just use the dev console to fly over there do 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 and slow that down there we go. F9 at 1. And then we are enter. And I want to see if this is going to pick up a load. Take job. It's letting me so far. Oh, man. Oh, if we push the wipers, are they... Yes, they're wiping the windshield like they should. Very good. All right, is this going to allow me to pick up this trailer? It is. It is. It's going to allow... <laughs> All right, so we can we can pick up the trailer. And we can drive around with it. The legs are scraping in the ground. It doesn't quite look right, but we're, <laughs> we're driving along with the trailer. Oh, my goodness. Oh, uh, well, at least we know that uh, this could be, a, you know, in the weekly drive. But we're not putting this in the weekly drive. We're just being silly is what we're doing. Oh, dear. We, well, we're turning here. There we go. <laughs> oh, really, you'd see sparks flying behind you with the uh, the legs down if the truck could pull it. <laughs> oh, that's pretty funny. That is very funny. Well, guys, that is pretty much it for this mod review. Um... <laughs> Yeah, we're just this week. Um, we're just taking a look at some of the mods to see what they have, what other mods have to offer. While we're actually doing the best of weekly drive, 
Now, if you've not heard of the Best of Weekly Drive, that is where we get together and we vote for the best trucks that were in this Weekly Drive series. Now, there's 10 trucks that you can choose from and um, they're on the actual Junior Senior Gaming website. So if you'd like to go check those out, please do so. Um, that way you can go and uh, vote because voting is very important, guys. It's very important that you vote for the weekly drive. But as for this one, I don't know. Look, guys, if you like this video, then don't forget to punch that like button in the ass. And that not only tells me that you like this video and you'd like to see more, but it also tells me other statistics as well. But in this is, and if this is the first time you're seeing Junior Senior Gaming, then make sure you head on over to the Junior Senior Gaming channel and check it out. There's over 1,500 video, sorry, 1,900 videos for you to uh, to watch. So plenty to keep you amused. Uh, we try to look at vehicle simulation, so uh, mostly trucks is what we do, but uh, we do do a whole heap of cars as well. So because we love our fast cars. Fast cars and trucks, mate. Gotta, gotta love it. But until next time, don't forget to keep the shiny side up and the greasy side down. And I'm 1010 on the side. And remember, game on.